Prudy, this is a major investigation into allegations Chinese government agents have infiltrated a political office. What more do we know? Yeah. Tom, this is a very serious what's happening this morning. The AFP has raided the home in Sydney of a New South Wales Labor MP, Shakat Mossel Main. Now, they are also trying to seek access, it's my understanding, to raid his office in the New South Wales Parliament. But that is a very sensitive issue given the parliamentary privilege that goes on in a place like the New South Wales Parliament. It's my understanding that they're currently trying to negotiate that access and just try and tick it off before it's done. This is something the AFP is doing on behalf of ASIO. It's been stressed that the AFP is conducting these, but they're executing the search warrants on behalf of ASIO. And that's quite significant given there's a high threshold that ASIO would have to start going into the offices and the homes of politicians, even at the state level. It's stressed, though, that just because the search warrant is out that there's been executed, that is not guarantee that any charges will necessarily be laid here. The nine newspapers first broke this story this morning. It's regarding allegations that Chinese government agents may have infiltrated the office of this New South Wales Labor MP. I've confirmed in a statement from ASIO that this is underway. ASIO says to Sky News that they can confirm that search warrant activity is occurring in Sydney this morning as part of an ongoing investigation. They go on to say this activity does not relate to any specific threat to the community and whilst this activity is occurring, it would not be appropriate to comment any further. There is an identical statement that's now been provided by the federal police. As for comments out of his office, I've tried to get in contact with them. They are not answering the phone. The same goes for the New South Wales Labor leader. They have also not returned Sky News' calls. But, Tom, this is a pretty significant story, given if there is a prosecution laid off the basis of these allegations of foreign interference, it would be one a world first, really. We have not seen this sort of successful prosecution if it comes to that when it comes to foreign interference.